We're about to show you the new 2022 Winnebago Echo. Stick around. We're just back from Elkhart, Indiana, RV capital of the world, where we were honored to be invited to host the RV Business Magazine's RV of the Year Awards for 2022. This is the fifth and last of the five video tours of the finalists in our behind the scenes series. See the new styling and innovation, the Winnebago Echo. And stick around to the end to learn more about the official awards announcement and winner. This is the brand new Winnebago Echo Class C Motorhome. We didn't get to see this unit in person because we were only in Elkhart, Indiana for this trip and there was a separate film crew capturing footage for the main RV of the Year video. We really wanted to include a video for you so you can see all five finalists. So this video is put together with photos and video provided by Winnebago and the knowledge we gained from their website and talking to Rick Kessler and the team who narrowed down the RVs to the top five finalists. The Winnebago Echo is a Class C RV built with off-grid adventures in mind. On Winnebago's website, they describe it as combining the efficiency of a camper van, the added capacity of a Class C coach, and the enhanced capability of all-wheel drive to create not just a new model, but an entirely new type of RV. It is built on the all-wheel drive Ford Transit chassis with 3.5 liter EcoBoost engine that has 310 horsepower and 400 foot-pounds of torque. With a 10-speed automatic transmission, that is a lot of power for a small, lightweight Class C. It has a 31-gallon fuel tank for long range and is loaded with modern automated safety features. It's off-grid ready straight from the factory with a second alternator dedicated to charging the lithium batteries and 455 watts of solar. It also has 50 gallons of fresh water, which is the most I have seen on a motorhome this size. There's tons of awning for this relatively small coach. There's the main patio awning like most RVs, but it also has an extra swing out awning on the back driver corner that wraps around creating a super cool space. The lower height compared to normal awnings, which I expect would provide lots of flexibility in making sure you can always find a shady spot to sit with this rig. There's an optional outdoor kitchen with two burner stove top and electric cooler right next to the entry door. It's great for all kinds of weather because the water tanks and all water lines are inside above the floor for better protection. And there's extra all season insulation in the roof and walls. Dual pane acrylic windows and multiple insulated exterior compartments. It has a flexible floor plan with optional pop top roof for added sleeping capacity and it has tons of storage, enough to carry full-size bikes inside the rear of the coach. The automotive style seats in the dinette area for extra passengers even have seat tethers if needed. There are two tables in the dining and work area, one flip-up table on the driver's side and a swivel and height adjustable table on the passenger side. The front driving seats do swivel to use inside the main living and dining area. It has a flexible twin bed floor plan with the option to connect those two beds into one large bed surface. The interior color options are gray with slate green or a bold red color. It also has an innovative bathroom design with wet dry bath. 50 gallons of fresh water and a similar sized gray tank, but it comes with a cassette toilet with only 5 gallons of capacity, which some might find limiting depending on where and how you'd like to camp. The bottom line is we think this is a very innovative and cool new RV and really look forward to seeing one in person soon. Let us know what you think in the comments below. Do you like this Winnebago Echo? And do you think it will win RV of the Year? Let us know in the comments below. We're posting videos daily between now and November 15th when you can catch interviews with the finalists and announcement of the winner at 12 noon Eastern, November 15th, 2021 at RVBusiness.com. Now go check out the other video tours here on our channel and our behind the scenes interview with Rick Kessler of RV Business who shares how they select the RV of the Year finalists and the winner. Remember to like the video, hit the subscribe button, click the bell for notifications and watch all the videos in the RV of the Year series. Thanks for watching.